Asashu State Panel of Inquiry on Police Brutality and Extrajudicial Killings and its sitting. The chairman, Aki Oladimeji, says the panel will ensure fairness and equity in its recommendations to the state government. Our correspondent, Olasukomi Ogumuko, completes the report as presented from our studio. Out of the 34 petitions, 11 were struck out for lack of competent prosecution, while 23 contested. The panel chairman, retired Justice Akin Oladimeji, explained that the panel had to work within the time frame to beat six months' deadline given to the panel to submit its final reports. Oladimeji noted that the panel has justified the confidence reposed in it by giving all the petitioners fair hearing so as to strengthen judicial process for justice. 34 petitions were filed with us and uh, we have concluded all the cases. So we are winding up today uh, to go and review the evidence and submission of counsel before we make recommendation to the government. There we had 34 petitions and uh, 11 of them were struck out due to uh, incompetence or lack of diligent prosecution. The other 23 cases, parties gave evidence in them and counsel represented the parties too. According to one of the petitioners, Teslimi Bitoye, who said a bullet got stuck in his body since 2017, appealed to government to save him from excruciating pain. Though he expressed hope that the panel would dispense justice without fear or favor. There is a bullet in my teeth as I'm standing here. And April 15, this, April 25 this year will make it four years I'll be going around with this thing. And it's killing me little by little. And he, as you can see, the last time, the first time I first came here, I wasn't there. Because it's coming close now, the pain and everything is more again. So I'll have to bear this one thing maybe around June again to subside a little. That is how I live my life for the past almost four years. You know. At the same time, I want them to take me to a better hospital. I don't care if it's abroad, where they can extract this bullet out of me. It's getting out of hand, and I'm seriously not interested in this inside me again. <laughs> It will be recalled that the panel was inaugurated in November 2020 in the state to address issues on police brutality and other injustices meted out to people and had six months to submit its final reports. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.